Hey guys, welcome to yet another interesting session by IntelliPath. And today we are going to look at the top 10 technologies to learn in 2019. Not everything in the universe is constant except change. We adopt the changes and that is how the world keeps developing. The same thing applies to technology as well. Latest trends in every technology help in making the world a better place to live. So over here we have discussed some of those top trending technologies to learn in 2019. At number 10 in the list is Internet of Things. IoT has become a hot topic in the present tech-driven world. A strong framework of cloud computing, backed up by seamless blending of sensors and actuators with the environment around us, is making this network of autonomous objects a reality. From smart wearables to smart cities, from domestic life to industries, IoT is expanding itself to different areas. Smart security solutions, smart home automation, smart healthcare, and smart wearables are some of the applications of IoT. And by the near future, we expect to see its application to a city's transportation system or smart power grids. Some of the popular development tools which can be used for IoT are Arduino, Eclipse, and IBM Watson. So anyone who is fascinated by the internet and understands the basics of programming languages like C, C++, and has a general idea of embedded systems, can build a career in Internet of Things. Next in the queue is cybersecurity. In an increasingly digital world, the looming threat of cyber attacks is more real than ever. These attacks are usually aimed at accessing, changing, and destroying some sensitive information. Thus, businesses need experts who can protect data, systems, and digital services used on a daily basis. Therefore, it is necessary for businesses to have apt cybersecurity measures in place to counter off all these threats. There is a high demand for skills to understand cyber issues and identify, diagnose, and resolve these challenges. Cybersecurity refers to a set of techniques used to protect the integrity of networks, programs, and data from attack, damage, or unauthorized access. It represents the ability to defend against and recover from accidents like hard drive failures or power outages. Some of the top trending cybersecurity technologies are threat intelligence, risk based authentication, remediation, and IoT security. These technologies are either implementing AI and machine learning or securing new endpoints from the IoT. Some of the top cybersecurity companies of 2018 are AppGuard, CA Technologies, Simcor Incorporation, CyberArk, CyberGym Control, and Delta Risk. So someone with a good understanding of computer networks and HTTP communication protocols can start their career in cybersecurity technologies. The next technology in the list is virtual reality and augmented reality. Virtual reality is defined as the use of computer technology to create a simulated environment. VR may be artificial such as an animated scene or an actual place that has been photographed and included in a VR app. With virtual reality, you can move around and look in every direction, up, down, sideways, and behind you as if you are physically there. You can view virtual reality through a special VR viewer such as the Oculus Rift, Vive, or Daydream View. With virtual reality apps, you can explore places you've never been to, such as the surface of the Mars, the top of Mount Everest, or areas deep under the sea. And augmented reality is defined as an enhanced version of reality created by the use of technology to add digital information on an image of something. AR apps use a phone's camera to show you a view of the real world in front of you, then put a layer of information, including text or images on top of that view. Apps can use AR for fun. The best example is the game Pokemon Go. Or for information, we have the app player. So AR and VR serve the customer with an enhanced experience and this technology is applicable in various industries like gaming, entertainment, travel, and education. So if you have a basic understanding of the OOPS concept, and if you know the different hardware used in the AR and VR ecosystem, then you can develop your career in this technology. Next in the list is data integration. ETL refers to extract, transform, and load, and is generally used for data warehousing and data integration. It enables companies to transfer data from various sources, cleanse and reformat it, and then load this data into a database to analyze and support business operations. It is a crucial component in the development of business intelligence through data integration. The ETL process ensures that this data is consolidated and stored in a data warehouse in a uniform presentation. So anyone with basic understanding of databases or SQL can start their career in this technology. 
the benefits an organization achieves with ETL tool are enhanced business intelligence, increased query and system performance, enhanced quality and consistency, high return on investment. There are many ETL tools available in the market currently like Informatica, Oracle Data Integrator, Microsoft SQL Server, Talon, SAP Business Object, IBM Data Stage, and Pentaho. And at number 6 in the list is DevOps. First, let's make it clear that DevOps is not a technology. It is a practice which seeks to bring together software developers and operation staff to work on the same project in a more collaborative manner. It is a software development method that stresses communication, collaboration, and integration between software developers and IT operation professionals. So as the name indicates, DevOps is a combination of development and operations. There are many benefits which we receive from DevOps model, such as speed, rapid delivery, reliability, scale, improved collaboration, and security. Some of the tools used in DevOps are Git, Jenkins, Docker, Puppet, Chef, Kubernetes, and Ansible. There are many companies which are using DevOps like Amazon, Facebook, Netflix, and Google. So if you have basic knowledge of Linux systems and have the ability to manage systems, applications, and infrastructure, then you can build your career in DevOps. Next in the list is data analytics and visualization. So we are witnessing a quantum leap in data produced by multiple sources. But all the data in the world is useless if you can't understand it. Data analytics and visualization is about how to present your data to the right people at the right time in order to enable them to gain insights most effectively. With the help of analytics and the right visualization tool, organizations can identify future opportunities and an optimal solution for their existing problems. So companies like Google, Facebook, Amazon, Apple, Netflix, and Twitter, all of them are making better decisions with the help of data visualization. Some of the most amazing data analytics and visualization tools are Tableau, MSBI, ClickView, Power BI, Oracle Business Intelligence, MicroStrategy, SAP Business Object, and SAS. So if you have an analytical bent of mind with basic knowledge of mathematics and have the ability to understand data and find patterns in it, then you should start your career in data analytics and visualization. At number four in the list is Big Data. Big Data has been getting a lot of attention over the last few years. Big data refers to problems that are associated with processing and storing different types of data. Most of the companies today rely on big data analytics to gain huge insights about their customer, product research, and marketing initiatives. So there are several trends and innovations happening in this space. Industry experts are suggesting that big data in the future will not be about what data to use, but rather about what data to ignore. The focus will be more on data quality. Some of the trendy big data technologies that you can use to promote your business are Hadoop, Apache Spark, Apache Flink, NiFi, Kafka, Apache Samza, and NoSQL. With these tools, the power of big data and mobility can truly elevate businesses to new levels. Using big data, telecom companies can predict customer churn in a better way. Retail industries can predict what products will sell. Insurance companies understand how well their customers actually drive and even government election campaigns can be optimized using big data analytics. Of course, there are so many other applications of big data and there'll be many new categories as the tools become more widespread. So if you have good knowledge of Java, SQL and Linux and you're interested to work with large amounts of structured and unstructured data, then surely you should accelerate your career in this piece. So next in the list is cloud computing. Cloud computing is the delivery of computing services such as servers, storage, database, networking, software, and analytics over the internet. That is cloud. Companies offering these computing services are called cloud providers and typically charge for cloud computing services based on usage. Uh, this is actually similar to how you are billed for water or electricity at home. There are several advantages of cloud computing like less cost, 24-7 availability, fast and scalable, and better security. There is a lot of competition out there in the market. Some of the famous cloud provider companies are Amazon Web Services, Salesforce, Microsoft Azure, IBM Cloud, and Google Cloud. So if you have basic knowledge of virtualization technologies and networking, then it would be good to have a career in this technology. At number two in the list is blockchain. It is the future of internet. Like the name indicates, a blockchain is a continuously growing list of records called blocks that contain information for the understanding of a common man which are linked and secured using cryptography. 
It is the leading digital assets platform which records and controls the monetary information. Blockchain is a technology that runs Bitcoin and Bitcoin is the world's first cryptocurrency and cryptocurrency is the future of the economy. There are many benefits of using blockchain like it provides transparency because anyone with access to a blockchain can view the entire chain. It also provides immutability. So once a data or transaction is recorded on the blockchain, it cannot be reversed. There are no practical ways of going back and changing or editing any data that has been recorded on the blockchain. It also provides better security against data being stolen or being misused. Without data being available in one place, transactions can take place at a faster pace. It reduces cost as well. So beyond just financial services, blockchain technology has many potential applications in governance, insurance, retail and healthcare. The use of blockchain is growing and businesses are in need of skilled professionals to gain a competitive edge. So to become a developer, you need basic knowledge of OOPS distributed systems and even a non-technical person with basic knowledge of banking and finance can start their career in blockchain. And the first technology in our list is artificial intelligence and data science. There is a lot of buzz about AI and data science in the market currently. Data science skills are increasingly being used in the domain of artificial intelligence. Machine learning, which is a subset of the artificial intelligence field, needs a lot of the skills that a data scientist possesses, like data cleansing, data wrangling, data parsing, building mathematical models, and working with algorithms. So data scientists are being much sought after in the artificial intelligence domain to build complex data models, train the machine learning systems with the right data, work with algorithms and make mathematical calculations. And data scientists can also fine tune the outcome of deep learning systems using statistics, probability and automation approaches. AI and DS is applicable in manufacturing, retailing, transportation, finance, healthcare and virtually every other industry. So if you're evaluating career options in this emerging field, then you should have basic knowledge of mathematics and probability with basic level of programming experience on any language. And if you have experience in Python, then it would be added advantage as nowadays Python is majorly used in the AI projects. By this, we come to the end of this video. Now that we know what all technologies you should learn, here is a list of training provided by IntelliPath. AI and data science, blockchain, cloud computing, big data Hadoop, BI tools, DevOps, Salesforce, SAP, programming and databases. To know more about these courses, please visit our website. Thank you for watching the video. Do like and share it. If you have any questions, comment below and we'll respond to them as soon as possible. Also, do subscribe to IntelliPath channel so that you can keep yourself updated on the latest technologies. You can also go through other related videos in our playlist. And for more information, visit our website. Keep learning, keep improving.